cool and breezy on this Monday afternoon. Let's get to Chief Meteorologist David Carnes. David. I would even say windy to start our work week, but mm -hmm. feels nice outside though. Boy, what a wonderful weekend. Uh, we got to enjoy the nice chilly weather. Hopefully even in the morning you went out there just to feel how chilly it was and then you went right back inside to enjoy the warmth, right? Cloud cover and a little bit, especially the further north you go. We're going to see some of these clouds working their way through. I'm going to call it a partly cloudy sky tonight. Going out for an evening stroll, no problems at all. 76 right now we will drop through the 70s, ultimately into the upper 60s by later this evening. Right now, 76. Look at the dew point. Very dry air still in place. And look at the wind. Winds out of the west southwest, 19 miles per hour. It is blowing pretty good out there. Uh, right now, 76 Chattanooga. 75 Dalton, Cleveland at 75, 70 and Murphy feeling good up in the Blue Ridge Mountains. Well, that 19 mile per hour wind is the uh, peak wind, sustained wind that we have being uh, showing up on the map here, but 11 miles per hour all coming out of the south and southwest, 14 miles per hour in Fort Payne. And here are some of the peak wind gusts that we've had today. We have had wind gusts in excess of 30 miles per hour around Chattanooga. Heading into Tuesday, it's going to be breezy. I don't know that it'll be as windy as it was. I'm going to say 10 to 15 mile per hour winds, maybe wind gusts up to 20 miles per hour. Notice uh, a little more mild in the morning. We'll be in the low 50s where we have been in the 40s and we're going to see it even 30s for a lot of you, right? Uh, climbing up to about 80 tomorrow afternoon. Overall, mostly sunny skies. So warming to start the week. We're going to have a few spotty showers with some cloud cover later in the week and then cooler air sliding back in for your Sunday. So right now you've got this uh, area of low pressure to our north. That's what's pushing in some of those clouds. I don't see any rain with those clouds moving through future cast taking us into the evening. We're going to be fine Tuesday. This weak front slides through high pressure builds in behind it. Maybe a couple of degrees cooler uh, as we move into the middle of the week. We're going to call it uh, the mid 70s as we head into Wednesday. Clouds building up though and look by late Wednesday. We may have a couple of spotty showers trying to work their way into the Tennessee Valley coming up from the south. Uh, chance of rain Wednesday. I'll put it at 20%. Thursday I'll bump us up to about a 30% chance of spotty showers here and there. Notice the cloud cover. So we're going to have a lot of cloud cover, a few spotty showers here and there through Friday, even into Saturday, and then we'll have another shot of colder air moving in by next weekend, similar to last weekend. So partly cloudy, not as chilly tonight. Drop down into the low 50s. You'll still need a light jacket as you're heading out tomorrow morning, and then tomorrow afternoon, throw it away. 81 for the high. Mostly sunny, a bit breezy through the day. Those winds staying out of the southwest about 10 to 15 miles per hour. Cranking it up to 80 in Dalton, 80 in Scottsboro, in Fort Payne, 77 Athens to 75 in Murphy and your storm alert seven day forecast. Again, chances of a few spotty showers, the cloud cover, all of that will keep it a little bit cooler in the afternoon, but it's really Sunday into Monday when we see that next shot of colder air sliding in. Low 60s for our highs, lows dropping down into the 40s again by next Monday morning.